bit more color. And I do think the sunrise this morning will be pretty nice too. Yes, we have the smoke in the atmosphere, but it is high up, so you're not breathing it in. That's why we don't have any air quality alerts from yesterday or today. As we go through the rest of the day today and tomorrow, that cold front continues to push to the south, and it's going to continue to move that air down in a southerly direction. So any of that leftover haze continues to disperse. So it's looking to be even clearer and brighter for today and tomorrow looking really nice as we lead into the weekend. This is the cold front right now. You can see a few spotty showers and even a few weak spotty thunderstorms down to the south, pretty much riding along this front. Behind it, we are dry and we are clear and we have less humidity, which is the big change in the forecast. Temperatures didn't change all that much, but the humidity levels did. Here's a look at future track. Any cloud cover continuing to move out. Sunshine in store for today and dry conditions. So if you're doing lunch on the square on this Thursday or anything else, you are good to go. We do stay clear and we do stay dry for tonight with temperatures tonight and to tomorrow morning dropping into the upper 50s. So if you want to leave some of the windows cracked at night to air out the house, not a bad opportunity. Temps this morning are in the upper 50s and low 60s. It's 63 here in Fort Wayne, upper 50s in DeKalb County and Steuben County, 61 in Paulding right now, 62 in Huntington, 62 in Columbia City. As for temperatures today, here's how we warm things up by about 10 a.m. Upper 60s across the board, making into the upper 70s right around 1 to 2 p.m. And highs today in the low 80s for many of us. Low 80s are going to stick around for the late afternoon and even through the evening later tonight. That's when we start to drop down a little bit more, making it back into the upper 50s for tomorrow morning. We have overnight lows in the 50s for tonight and tomorrow night. But then we start to warm up a little bit more over the course of the weekend. And not only are we warming up over the course of the weekend, humidity slowly on the rise. Saturday, you're fully dry and good for outdoor plans. By the second half of Sunday, we could see the chance for a few spotty showers. It doesn't look to be a washout. And if you're doing any morning services on Sunday morning, maybe doing the grocery run, whatever else it is for your routine, things should be fine for the morning hours. Rain chances pick up at night. Then Monday and Tuesday, those two days will have our highest rain chances for the week ahead, dealing with some spotty showers and even a few spotty thunderstorms. Temperatures going into next week in the mid 80s, looking at a slightly above average trend by just about a degree or two, but all in all still maintaining that trend of the 80s that we've had for the past several days. Yeah, and even with the chance for showers on Sunday, Liz, it still looks really good. Yes, mm -hmm. it does. Okay, thank you. Continue.